Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today is Thursday and we're getting ready for the second fall launch which there's launching new candles, uh, restocking a couple, new different sizes of candles too. And then I'm also releasing t-shirts in the fall designs that we came out in the crewnecks. So it's currently 2.44. I'm kind of starting this late, but I did watch my nieces this morning and I've been up since 5.30, so I desperately need another coffee already. I had a triple shot espresso drink this morning and it's starting to wear off now. So we gotta go get another one of those. I have pictures and everything all ready to go besides like the candles. I need to do those. I also need to... We need to go to Target and get some fall decor. I want to put up a couple stuff in my entryway to take pictures of the candles for my feed. And then we're going to do the email marketing, text marketing, all that good stuff. So first stop is Target. <laughs> so I ended up getting my... Starbucks in Target, obviously. Uh, my use the double espresso blonde with four pumps of vanilla and 2% milk. The barista was kind of stunned that I found a hack for the vanilla latte, and I was like, TikTok. <laughs> I'm gonna move because people are staring at me filming, and I still get nervous doing that. So we're gonna we're gonna move to the back of the parking lot. Okay, I moved to the back and hopefully this is still good lighting. I have a pop socket on my phone and so I got this. Did I need it? Probably not, but I'm gonna put somewhere on my car so I can put like my phone in it instead of having that in the cup holder and taking up space. And then I got a sign that says fall is my favorite. It was in the dollar section. Then of course I got some pumpkins. This is a black, green, and white one. It matches my entryway. So these will be perfect. It's just like subtle. It's not fall on your face. Those were also from the Target dollar section. Then also from the dollar section I got dish towels. I got this one with like the plaid. And then I got this one with the green that matches. And then these look really busted up but they're supposed to be a DIY frame and I'm just gonna paint them and then put photos in them, but I thought they'd be super cute in my entryway. Yeah, that's my Target haul. We're gonna go home. I just got home and the lighting might be bad in my entryway. Don't mind it. But I'm gonna be taking product photos of the new black cedarwood candle and then also the pumpkin souffle. Cause I feel like these are gonna be pretty good sellers. So let's... Let's hope they are. Okay, I like that setup, so we're gonna try and replicate it, and then, oh, okay. I honestly never know how pictures are gonna turn out, so I always try and just take like a bunch. Yeah, that looks so plain. That is, can you see it? Look so bad. <laughs> That's just why you take a lot of photos, so then you have options. I really like this one. So, that might be a contender. Now we gotta do the pumpkin souffle. Okay, I think we're gonna go with that and call it good. I decided that I need some pictures of the apple pie one too to post in like the carousel for today's post. Um, because that's a new kind too, and I feel bad for it. <laughs> and honestly, they all smell so good, so I don't want to leave anyone out. So we're gonna take some photos of that one. My light box is from Amazon. I'll have it linked in the description. Best purchase I've ever made. I want to say it was like 30 bucks, and it's so nice. Honestly, while I'm at it, I might as well take pictures of all of the candles because they're all new sizes. So I'm just going to do that, get that out of the way right now. They're so cute. 
I finished editing all the pictures on my phone and now I'm just going to do the email marketing and the text marketing and then uploading all the products onto my website. So not much going on. I'm literally going to be just in the background having a movie on probably. I'm all snuggled up in my blanket from MS Designs and it's so freaking comfy you guys. I'm not kidding. This is the best blanket ever and it's so comfy. Perfect for fall weather. There's Susie <laughs> looking out the window, but Oreo's gonna help me do the email marketing and text marketing while we watch a movie. It has officially been a couple hours since doing the email marketing, uploading the products, SMS marketing. Uh, I'm trying to drink the rest of my coffee because I'm starting to crash and it's 7 o'clock. But honestly, I don't have really anything else to do tonight. I'm just going to probably bag and tag tomorrow and just double check inventory tomorrow too. I'm just going to spend the rest of the night probably on the couch um, snacking on cream cheese everything pretzel thins and my coffee so cheers and I'll see you tomorrow good morning guys so I'm currently just making some breakfast and then after a breakfast we're gonna tag and bag all of the t-shirts I'm wearing the skeleton one for launch day I'm gonna show you quick how to make this Bella from just be kind co showed me this when I visited her so good. So she uses guac, but I just do a mashed up avocado with the everything bagel seasoning, jalapeno, garlic powder, salt and pepper, and then some lime juice. And then I just mash it up and put half of it onto each hash brown. And for the seasonings, you just do like whatever your little heart desires. Then I'm going to take my grated parmesan cheese and just shake a whole lot of that over top and then I'm going to take my Frank's mini red hot sauce I love hot sauce you don't have to put it on but it's recommended perfect and then you're going to take your egg now I do I don't even know what this is but the yolk's not runny <laughs> you put that on you can do like scrambled eggs sunny side up whichever voila and I just eat this with a fork you can pick it up and eat it I just eat it with a fork but there's breakfast and then I also have my coffee of course so I'm gonna go eat this in my office and then probably gonna bag and tag shirts
I'm honestly so tempted to keep one of the new candles. They literally smell so good. My favorite might have to be the black cedarwood juniper because it literally smells like men's cologne and I love men's cologne. It's like subtle, but it's there. It smells so good. Everything is officially done and ready for launch. So the next three hours, I'm just going to be doing some behind the scenes work on what's coming to BMC. So I thought while we wait for launch time, I could talk to you guys about some stuff. Honestly, I'm not getting my hopes up about this launch. I haven't been getting my hopes up about recent launches lately. I just feel like if I don't get my hopes up, then I can't get my heart broken, which might sound kind of stupid, but lately it's been slow. I know I post the highlights of my business. In reality, I feel like I should stop as I'm a mental health based business. All those orders that I posted about came from my sales section when I had my entire sales section for like 40 and 30% off. I have just been kind of losing myself a little bit and seeing what my business is really about. And honestly, I haven't been happy with it lately. I feel like I lost what my business needed to say about it and how I am a mental health based and positivity business that creates products showing those and a lot of my products don't show that at all. The past couple of weeks I just kind of been down and out. I haven't been motivated to do anything. Not because I don't love you guys, it's just because I fell out of love with the business and I never want to stop doing this business and that's why I need to change some things. So if you're watching this, you now know what I have been feeling and what I plan to do with Brenna M & Co. It's still going to be my baby and I'm still going to do it full time. I'm just going to bring in products that I truly love. Like I love everything, but some products that I truly love and I'm only going to have a couple. Like I'm not going to have... I'm pretty sure I have over 100 products in my shop right now, and I'm going to try and narrow that down to like 25. So a lot of stuff is going to be in the sales section. A lot of stuff is going to be very discounted, and I'm just ready for the new beginnings for Brenna M & Co. The third year is going to be the best year, and I think it's time to get back to what I started. Now, I'm not going to make this sad or anything. So we're just gonna see you when it's officially launch time. Okay, so it's officially one minute until launch. I was on the couch kind of doing some stuff for this, but we're now in the office and we're going to go to the password and I'm protected at five o'clock. All right, five o'clock. Password is officially off. We're going to go and post on all socials that the launch is officially live. So far we have five people on the website, which I mean it's two minutes after launch, but like I said earlier, I wasn't expecting a whole lot. We now have 12 visitors. All right, everything is looking good. We have a couple visitors on about 13 no orders yet but I'll probably package orders tomorrow go live tomorrow and catch you guys in on how we did well it has been a couple days now we got five orders from the launch which that's fine like as I was saying earlier wasn't expecting a whole lot so I mean I'm just grateful for one honestly and so we're gonna go ahead and package those up, I think. Yeah, we're gonna package them up. Our first order is for Casey, and Casey got the pumpkin, apple pie, and black cedar wood candles. 
So this is the pumpkin souffle, apple pie, and the black cedarwood juniper. These are the four ounce candles. And then she also got the skeleton tea, two of them. Next order is for Karen. Karen got the 13 ounce apple pie candle, which is this one. <laughs> Lots of bubble wrap. Next order is for Brooke, and Brooke got a skeleton sticker, and then the Taking Care of Myself t-shirt, the pumpkin tea, and skeleton one. Oh, I forgot to put the package on YouTube stickers. There we go. I'm gonna add it to the other two orders that we packaged already. Okay, next order is for Hannah. Hannah got the Meadow Floral Sun Catcher. This one, you can kind of see it maybe. And then she also got the Ash Earth Zip Up. And on the back this says, make the world a better place. This is also Hannah's first order. Oh, she gets the Brenna M & Co. clear rainbow sticker as a freebie to say thank you for your first order. Our last order is for Katie. Katie got the Mess Up Dear Me Purple Zip Up as well as the Love More Worry Less Zip Up. And it's so cute, they're both purple. So this is the back of the Love More Worry Less Zip Up. And then here's the front of the Dear Me Zip Up. And this is Katie's first order. So she gets the clear Brenna M & Co rainbow sticker as a freebie.
We have all of the existing orders packaged and ready to go out tomorrow. And I'm going to end the video here. I know it kind of was not really what I was expecting, but also expecting at the same time. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, please give it a big thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're not already. And I just want you to know that if you are a small business owner, there's going to be launches that are bad. Like, that's just, that's just the life of being a business owner. And just because someone has a lot of following doesn't mean that their launches are always successful. So I hope you guys take that into consideration next time you have a launch and it flops because your future is so bright and you got this. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys!